Here at the International Food Network in the UK, food scientists are making a new sports drink. It contains a novel ingredient, which can't be disclosed, thought to improve an athlete's performance. But apart from this, the drink is made up of common ingredients. So what you usually have is some sort of preservative. You have citric acid that helps to control acidity. You have some sort of carbohydrate. And then there will be your active ingredients. Again, depending on functionality, you could have vitamins, you could have some electrolytes if you want to replenish the salts lost in sweat, or you could perhaps have caffeine. And you would also have colors to make the drink look orange. And you would have flavor to make the taste of what fits within um, athletes desire. Once the ingredients have been measured out, they're mixed together. A magnetic stirrer allows all the ingredients to dissolve much quicker than if you were just to stir them with an ordinary spoon and just let them to dissolve by their own. When all the ingredients are in, the drink is checked to make sure everything has dissolved. Then we would have a quick taste prior to processing just to make sure that what we've just made is the same in line with what we've been making previously in the lab. This tastes fine. This is ready to go into the pasteurizer now. The drink is pasteurized by heating it at 75 degrees Celsius for 15 seconds. Afterwards, it's put into sterilized bottles using an enclosed hood to prevent contamination. Later the drink is tested, for example to verify acidity and sugar content. In this case, carbohydrate levels are close to zero, since an artificial sweetener was used. Next, athletes will test the drink to see how it impacts their performance.